ACV. Uh, and I set this tarp up here. We're going to be taking the ceiling down. It ain't coming from no plumbing over here, I don't think. So now we gotta go to the third floor, but let's let me double check. Let me double check up in here. Alright. Nothing's leaking on the second floor vanity. Nothing's leaking on this tub. Just some paper dust mask. This is the most patient I'm gonna to have to be in my life to teach these millennials how to plumb. I don't know if I can do it without screaming at them. I might scream at them a little bit. The paper mask are right on the passenger side, second shelf in a box. Why? What word did you turn on, Chuck Bates, or so I know? Well, one, I turned both on. They're both on right now. Yeah. All right. You went for the leak. <laughs> it's a little bit of time. It's crazy. I mean, this is really insane for plumbing, dude. Right now, the water's on for what? 30 seconds or so? Yeah. It looked like the water's coming right from that pipe, maybe squirting up, but now maybe it's coming from a drip from the above top. the floor. So you know what that means? I don't see a crack. Let's wait till it starts tripping again. Here's our leak. Uh, it's I definitely know. coming from upstairs. Alright. Let's go find it. Give me a tape measure. Let's measure this off. This narrow just leaked down to a leak in the wall from the second to the third floor. Angelo discovered it with a classic, what we like to call a sounding. I hear water dripping down right now. So we're gonna open up the wall. Angelo, we're gonna set it up in the closet here. Yeah, less damage, you know what I mean? Set it up on the floor. I'm gonna walk, I'm gonna walk upstairs and see what we got. Before I open the second floor closet wall, 
I got a feeling we got a pipe in here on the third floor. This house is a rooming house, right? Yeah. It's something funny. <laughs> is there something funny right here? Right here, right now. Is there something funny? Because we're about to do a demo. All right, room and house. Room and house. <laughs> so in a room and house, they would have a common bathroom on the third floor, and each bedroom would have its own little sink so you could brush your teeth. That's a drain line. There's water leaking in that floor right there. But there, used, there used to be a sink in here or something. All right? So what we're going to do is what? We're going to do some demo. Because why? We love demo. Guess what? I see water. So, I can really use that crowbar right about now. This floor has already been patched and repatched and Got AB. I, think I, I think I found a leak. I see it dripping right here. Oh, man. oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, I love it. Shut it off. We found her. Third floor bathroom. Cold. All right, no big deal. We love leaks. I love it, Angelo. I'm getting a shot of all shots. Get a little spray action? Yeah. What do we got? We do have a leak under here. It's right under this vanity. So it's either take the vanity out and bust up this tile floor. Which I really don't want to do. I cannot fix it from the closet because it's too tight. So I'm going to go downstairs and look at the ceiling. Because we're going to demo the ceiling. So we're going to come up from above? We're going to go in this ceiling because this is going to be the easier location to do some demo. And what happens is this is what happens when you don't winterize a house properly. We have a frozen iron pipe water line. What's that? Yeah. Here, I'll show you. Come on. Should I start it for you? Oh. Andrew, you know what we are going to need? What's that? Remember that can you were talking about getting? A recycle can? Yeah. Let's get that so we can dump in some trash. It's all awesome. Because guess what? This is demo day, and guess what? I just hit a home run. It's a home run demo day. Here's the pipe. No way, right? Yeah. Now you gotta check, make sure there ain't no wires, okay? Yeah, I got 
I'm gonna open this a little bit more. Trash. Really nice about this angel is the dust is blowing right out the window. All right, now, 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 iron pipe to copper. So we're going to go classic mega press from iron to copper. Clean up this mess. <laughs> All right, let me be quick about it. Is it done? Okay. Yeah, three hands. Alright, dustpan and brush, Chuck uh, Now it's actually iron pipe, it's 3 quarter by 3 8 iron. So what I'll do is convert right to copper. Okay. And AB is down there cleaning up, my youngin. See, we're going to try to teach the bees how to make a dollar. A little plumbing. I love, I love plumbing. Chuck, you're getting your dustpan brush, right? Yeah. I'm gonna walk down. It's three quarter iron pipe. Right? Three quarter by half inch copper. But an R10. Alright? I'll get you a dustpan brush from down there. Take a 5-8 wrench and pliers. 5-8, right? Yeah. Supply, right? Go upstairs. Tighten the toilet. Yeah, tighten the toilet. That toilet is about on the top. Yeah, we're going to do the toilet right now. The toilet is looking inside. We're going to fix the toilet now. Go upstairs and unhook the cold lab supply on the valve. The stainless thing. So when I cut this, we're going to pull it right down. The cold's leaking, the one on the right. Let's not make a mess, all right? No, I'm not. I'm gonna go right here. Because you guys are gods and we're learning. We're always learning. Good job, men. Be careful. All right, boys and girls. Oh my gosh. I wish I had a the left hand on this joke, right? CB, I messed up. I can't pull that valve through the hole. So, I'll cut it for you. Was that iron? Yeah, go pull that sink, go pull that pipe out. Here it is. Split. Iron pipe. Frozen. Crazy, man. This is the ticket. We're going to go from galvanized pipe to half inch copper. In this application, if I couldn't do that, I'd have to tear down this whole ceiling and get to a joint, which we don't want to do. We're going to dab right here, right now. So, in, in the real world, in the old world, we'd have to rip down this whole ceiling and go to a thread. See me? I just explained that on the camera. But I would have to cut down that whole ceiling and untwist that pipe to fix it. Did you have ProPress? I didn't have ProPress. You go from fitting to fitting because you can thread a male adapter into the old fitting over there where it would be good. Oh, uh, I got you. But now, just cut where you want. Cut where you want. Adapt to copper. Adapt to iron pipe and then from iron pipe, oh. you know, I make yeah. a, 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 an adapter. Oh, I got you. Just like so. All right. All right. Where's my glove? Are they downstairs?
We're going to get around. We're just going to get a rough measurement, okay? Cut it. All right, give me a, a measurement there. 13. Okay, thank you. CB2 has busted out our new tool, which I don't even know how to use yet, but he checked it out while I was at the supply house. The M12. Recommended by my plumber associates that roasted me for not having one. So now we got one. Wow, that's nice. I was going to slide it too. When you go pro with this thing, I could just see like where you go in a tight spot, like where we have where we have a cut against a wall or something. I was trying to figure out. What I'm telling. I'm gonna tell you. Right. I tell you what I think. When, uh, is it center of this fitting? When you're measuring here, so end of this fitting to the center of this. No, I was going from the end of this pipe end to center. Center of this. Okay. Now I'm just measuring backwards so I get the same measurement. Huh. And that's where you move on the function. <laughs> and I feel the way it's like you cut it out of your edit. <laughs> no, I'm not going to cut that out. It's natural. Adapt this to copper. We'll throw a little sand on it. You want to switch heads? <laughs> uh, yeah, we're gonna have to. Here goes the big adapter, baby. No, Chucky, not yet. Let's do the copper first. All right. All Is right. that one inch or three quarter? Three quarter. Oh. All right. And. Let's do this. Let's prefab this whole thing. Little prefab work. Here we go, Daddy. Go. Let's get it. Oh yeah. We'll put that slide that valve right on the copper, make sure it goes all the way down, snaps right on, and hook up the supply tube. complete job galvanized the copper that's a wrap boys it's a wrap boys <laughs> we're done